So you had somebody take parts off your bike too? Yeah, uh, Well, he, he took off it, like. It wasn't him, bitch. The people that's running his house, bitch. Oh, around him, that's that. Okay, yeah, they got people in their shop. That's why you got to get Nah, I'm, bigger. yeah. Them boys, they but he's that great. What? what they Put pit bike levels on yeah, there. That yeah, boy, that, that goes, boy. Like 135 for both? <laughs> like 235, right? Oh, yeah, them are ASV. Them are ASV ones. Damn. Oh, yeah. Oh, you got Yeah, you got Brian even. So they're taking screws off your bike, too. So you, you took the motor apart yourself? You took it apart? Yeah, bro, because look, I had to take it apart. Just the heads of the whole motor, or just the, the top head? Let me tell you what happened. So now while I'm breaking this shit down, right? Something told me, uh, what I was doing? I checked the oil. Boom, I look at the choice. It got that milkshake color. I'm like, oh. I'm like, shit. I'm trying to find out. Yeah. I took the oil off. Yeah. 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 So your heads used to be black on there? Used to be black? It was they spray painted. It was that. It, it used to be black, right? But oh. when I took it to Tommy, right? It wasn't a clean black, right? Oh, it was like that little nasty, that little. Yeah, because it was just they didn't never take care of it. He he used a can of spray paint just sprayed over the whole engine, so the whole engine was black. They just you gotta be kidding me, though. They just went crazy on it, bro. The whole motor was black. The whole motor was black, so I had to literally have Jesus to go Christ. And go get stripper paint stripper from Home Depot. Spray that bitch, let it sit, hit it with the pressure washer. I had to leave it in the dry spot for a month. Where now, it was supposed to be a deal, but now it's over. Now I got to keep it. Now it's like a keeper now. You got to. Unless give me 10 for it. That's how much I really got into that. 10 or better. But you know, now it's brown. Ain't got no money. Nobody ain't going to spend no 10. Over with. Hey, we were just talking, saying that. Over with. Nobody ain't got no money, bro. That's dead. You remember just saying that? See? Let me try to make a living off that right quick. Kept pushing it. Do uh, yeah, I got. I'm gonna have to pull out the. Yeah, but that's everything. Cause you just let me know what you need to deposit or something like that. Nah, we good. We good. I'm just gonna just just let me know. run through it. Yeah, yeah. Where, where I got I'm your number. That's your number. Okay, yeah, that's my number. Okay. My okay. So before, okay. My last question. Okay. Before you took the motor, were the heads off? You say you took the head, just the heads, right? Yes. Before you took the heads off, it was running. Before before you did that, it, when I okay, so I did get it to start. Once I put the motor on, did everything. But mind you, this is that I don't know. I had to get new one of these. Oh, okay. Right? So once I put that in, I don't even know if I put that on right. This was too tight. So whatever. I when I finally got it to start. Right? It was island real high. So I'm trying to get that to go down. Just trying to get it to um just idle just right, lower idle down. Right. With this over here, I'm just with everything. I'm stressed out, you know, sun beaming on my head. I'm like, I'm thinking about it too much. It. Then what happened was then it ran out of gas because I kept trying, it was starting. Right. Then what happened was I went and said, you know what? I went, it ran out of gas. I went to go put gas in, put the new batch of gas in there. Once I put the new batch of gas in there, nothing. I don't know if the mixture up. I don't think it was the mixture because, like I said, it was two to one for every Oh, yeah, like 32 to one. I got the little cup and everything. Oh, so you got the measuring cup, every measuring cup and everything. Okay. So I don't think that was it. Okay. It just, uh, my cousin also told me, oh, go, go ahead and change the spark plug. Sometimes the spark plug will burn out. Okay, just like fire out like the spark plug. Okay. He said, change it. I said, no, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> uh, 
You want to straight. take care of it? Yeah. Okay. As long as you take care of it, bitch, I'm good. Okay, let me know if you don't have a button. Handle it. Okay. Whatever else you see, cause that need to be, cause you know, I went over it, I tightened up all the bolts, but if you, if you just go through a little check, because when I got it from Tommy, right? Right. The chain was coming off, you know why? He never tightened these. Bruh. So every time, so when I went and test drive, right, that's what scared me to death and made me say, I'm gonna do it myself this time. You feel me? Because he left this shit loose. These it's was like it'd be hard to trust people sometimes work on bike. Cause that could've, that would've been uh, bad. Like, look, cause every time I'm go to fish tail, that bitch, the chain pop off, boom. I'm like, what the fuck going on? Then the chain could've came off and hit your engine case and, and it, ruined your motor. That's why I went and got the, the case saver. Look, I went and installed that just because it did happen, damn it. Oh. Look right there. Oh but I yeah. Cleaned it. I went and bought the case saver just because that shit happened so many times. Like, I can't let the case get fucked up because I already know a case was about 400. Easy. Wait, where you order the case saver from though? Uh, eBay. eBay for the case saver? Yeah. Okay. It looked good too. Yeah. It looked real good. Put it in there. I didn't think it was going to fit. I'm like, damn, they don't got no wiggle room in there. Right. I'm thinking, damn, <laughs> this shit ain't going to work. Wait a second. That bitch here looked like it rubbing a little bit. But we'll see. Yeah. It did fit. It went right in there. Boom. Fit it right on good. Tight. Yeah. And then that bitch, when it popped, that bitch went for sure. Let's go over there. But yeah, man. Go ahead, man. You know, I got to go out west. Okay. I gotta All go right. To the springs. I'm going to take care of you. All right. You're at the right me. place. You feel me? All right. All right. <laughs> I get off work now. So it's going to always be happy. On Saturdays and Sundays, I'm going to call me whenever. Okay. Come get it. Okay. Other than that, though, on Monday through Friday, after three. Okay, that's good with me. All right, yeah, yeah. all right. Hey, all right, boss. Yeah, we're gonna take care of Andre, man. That V-touch. Yeah.